Political correctness gone mad. This political correctness crap, well, I think most Aussies have had enough of the things that are really important. Pre C brigade don't seem to give a stuff. They all seem to be so worried about someone getting offended, chastising people for not following the guidelines they recommended. I've never heard the PC brigade speak up when someone sets our flag alight. Does their silence suggest that in their eyes this disgraceful action is all right? To support the desecration of something for which men have fought and died will surely cause division among Australians as patriots show their pride. Whenever I see our flag raised, I remove my hat and show some respect. The same for a national anthem. I believe this is politically correct. If you think these actions are old-fashioned, so be it. I really couldn't care. But disrespect my flag, sunshine. I've just one word, and that is beware. The 3rd of September 2016 will be our Australian National Flag Day. First raised in 1901, Aussies should and can be proud of the flag on display. So if you burn and spit upon our flag, we won't just stand idly by. Be prepared for all hell to break loose, as our pride we satisfy. If you don't respect our flag, then you disrespect where you live. It's an insult to proud Australians and something we can't forgive. Jails are far too good for you, and besides, it costs us taxpayers money. Live in another country. You're not wanted in the land of milk and honey. Oh, and P.S., if this verse upsets you because it is politically incorrect, too bloody bad. Because all the flame of bullshit you carry on with makes me bloomin' mad. Our flag is a symbol of who we really are, so show some fair dinkum pride. Beneath the flag that bears the Southern Cross, Aussies will stand side by side.